Hey guys, it's Joe, and today I went shopping. If you're wondering where I'm at, it's a different background. I am still in Frisco, Texas with my in-laws, but I went shopping today, so I thought I would give you guys a peek at the mini haul that I did today. I went to a store that I've been wanting to go to because we do not have in Florida. I've seen it all over the place on YouTube and different channels and I've been wanting to hit it up. They have a lot of them here in Texas. So I did hit one up in Plano, Texas. I am in Frisco, so it was about half an hour away from where I'm staying, but to me, it was worth the drive. I was hoping to find more like Kawaki stuff for my kids because they're really into like the Japanese culture and all the cutie stuff. I thought I was gonna find more of that kind of stuff, but I'm still very excited with the stuff I found because I freaking love Wish and I order from them almost every single day. So I found some stuff that normally I would order from Wish. So it's kind of cool to get it right then and there instead of waiting like three or four weeks because we all know if you order from Wish that it takes a long time to get the stuff since it comes from China. So anyways, let's get to my mini haul. I forgot I mentioned the name of the store. It's Day So if I'm not mistaken. Day, Day I So, something like that. The first thing I got here, it's a charcoal face wash. Look how cute that is. And I bought two of these, one for me and one for my daughter. I figured that I would buy her her own so she doesn't steal mine, because she usually does. I bought my son some chapsticks. No, chapsticks. <laughs> I bought my son some chopsticks because he loves eating with chopsticks. These were $1.50. Usually we buy them from Epcot at the Japanese store. They usually cost around five, six dollars or so. So $1.50 for these. <laughs> this little cushion here because I am here for my sister-in-law's 40th birthday. So this coming up weekend, we're gonna be celebrating it and I bought some heels and forgot to buy that cushion for the ball of my feet. So I know I'm gonna be in those shoes all day and I do not wanna be hurting. I am still dabbling and trying to put eyelashes on. I'm not very good. Every time I try, I fail, I get frustrated and I give up. So this is a three pack here that I got and again, $1.50. And then I found these cute little, they're called soft foot pads and they look like to me like you put them on your toes for pedicure so i bought two because hello i have two feet <laughs> now this i was really excited to see because i've been thinking about ordering it from wish but i wasn't really sure it says silicone heel cover stick set of two and a dollar fifty so i will be trying these out tonight and hopefully we'll see if I wake up a king tomorrow. This is another thing that I've been seeing. I've been seeing a lot of people on Instagram post little posts on these. And like I said in many of my videos when I do my makeup tutorials, I have a hooded eyelid. You see how they, they hood down that when, like if I put any eyeshadow underneath this crease right here, as soon as I open my eyes, it just completely goes away and you can't see it. So usually when I put eyeshadow on my eyes, I have to start up here so this is supposed to create an extra crease I don't know if it's gonna work but again a dollar fifty I don't have to wait three or four weeks before I get in the mail from wish so you know it doesn't hurt to try it out it's a charcoal deep purifying peel off mask I said why not so I'll be doing this as well this okay I already used one I bought two of these okay I'll tell you in a minute what they're for and my hair today looks so good guys I washed it today and I forgot to pack my diffuser to when I you know when my hair is wet to dry because it takes forever to dry on its own so this is supposed to be like hair drying glove where you put your hand in here and it feels like a towel like a nice soft towel so when my hair was wet after I put all the hair product in I was just like scrunching my hair up like this and removing all the excess water off my hair and then my hair dried so quickly and look how cute it looks there's no frizz in it at all today this was i love this i bought two again because my daughter my youngest tatiana vanessa is all my stuff so i got two i tried my one it's up there i keep looking up there because it's up there but this one's for her because she has curly hair as well. She's always taking my diffuser and forgetting to bring it back. So Tati, if you're watching, don't worry girl, I hooked you up. Oh, I'm getting hot up in here. Ooh, it's hot. 
Okay, the next thing I got, this is a basic line eyebrow template. And not that I need it, but I see stuff like this all the time. And I like to play around and just try different things. And then again, it's $1.50, so I'm like, why not? If I don't like it, I can always give it to somebody. Okay, now, guys, <laughs> this is funny, but okay, I did see these and I said, huh, let me try these out. Again, I think everything that I got was just $1.50. I don't think I spent more than a $1.50 on anything. These were $1.50 as well. And you're probably like, what the heck is that, Joe? Well, this is seamless flex, flex attention pants. It looks like little shorts. They're nice and stretchy and they look kind of comfortable. Your girl has big thighs, all right? So when I wear a dress, my thighs do touch and it's annoying. These look like something that I would wear underneath my summer dresses. Summer's coming up. Let me open it up and see because I have not opened these up. I don't know what they look like. I just read it for $1.50. It's a pair of two. <laughs> they look like a tidy whities like I stole my husband's white tidy whities but they're like little shorts breathable it says cut and stretchy so yeah I'll be wearing these under my dresses yeah they're not very sexy and pretty but it's not about that it's about comfort guys comfort oh these are two dollars okay I lied guys I did spend two dollars on an item so look at this they're nice and padded so I don't have to wear a bra so I got a gray one and a black one I've said many times and I just said not that long ago that I do live in Florida so I am always hot so I saw this cute fan in black usually I, the fans that I find have like little flowers on them or decorations on them and they you know they don't match my outfit so I saw this black one and I said look that's cute let me get it so look at that look how cute that is and actually it's hot in this bathroom right now so I'm about to fan myself guys it is hot oh yeah that feels good. Look how pretty that is. Isn't that cute? Yes. See me guys? I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. I like this one. This is cute. So this was $1.50 guys. So that was everything I got as far as items for makeup and hair and clothes and whatnot. The rest of the stuff I got is food and snacks and candy. I thought I am at this Japanese store and they had a lot of candy and snacks. Why not get a bunch of snacks that I can do a video with my nieces here? I spent about $55 today. But I went knowing that I was going to spend some money because it's not like this store is around my house where I live. So I said, you know what, let me just grab what I want. I would have grabbed more but because I had to fly back home. Half the stuff I wouldn't be able to fit in my luggage. Some of it was breakables. But at least I know that I can order online. That's a good thing. I don't know what this is. I saw it and I just grabbed it. It looks like pears in the picture. And it looks like it's a mix for a drink. But there is no instructions, so we're just gonna have to mess with this one. Oh, powdery beverage. That's all it says. It says description, powdery beverage. That's it. Don't tell me how to use it. Don't tell me how to milk water. I don't know what we're gonna mix it in, but we'll figure it out. So that's this. Language is not in English, and if there is, it's very little. So it's kind of hard to tell. I was just going by, does it look good? So this kind of looks good, and it kind of looks like um, sweet tarts. So I grabbed these. Creamy shake lollipops. It looks like lollipops that are like creamy shape. And then it has a bunch of like lemon, strawberry, chocolate little milk shake down here. So I'm assuming that this is probably gonna be like a, a white chocolate with flavor on there. There's six of them in there, so we'll be trying these as well. Uh, again, it doesn't really say much other than um, creamy shake lollipops, a good source of calcium. So yeah. Um, that's it. This is hot and spicy and it looks like potato chips. We can mix it with whatever this pear beverage is <laughs> if we get too hot. Creamy chocolate green tea. Chocolates. They look good. I don't know if the girls are gonna like the green tea but I like chocolate and I like green tea so I'm curious to taste what it tastes like together. So. This looks like something I would see at Epcot in the Japanese store, so I grabbed these. These were $2.50, guys. Yeah, Pocky green teas. I don't know, I'm just curious to find out what, what it tastes like, because I've never had the green tea other than drinking it, so it'll be kind of cool to actually eat it in something. I don't know what this is. I just thought it was really cute. Look how cute the little girl is. But I don't, I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's candy or if it's like a chip or 
popcorn. It looks like it could be popcorn in the picture. You see the little puff balls. So yeah, that's that. And then the last thing in here, I'm sure all of you guys have heard of the high chew. Um, this I see all the time at the store and I grab these for my kids. But the lady behind the counter told me, have I ever had these? And I said, oh yeah, I had high chew before. They're really good. My kids love them. She goes, no, have you had the sour ones? And I said, no. And she goes, try them. Cause she saw that I had all this other snacks. So I said, okay, are they really sour? And she said, yes. So that is it. That's all I got from the store. I'm really excited. If it was around the corner, I probably would go back. Oh, oh wait, I see something else over here that I got. I got the contact lens holder because, um, I need a new one. No reason. That's it. I need a new one. So that was $1.50. So my foot is falling asleep. Oh my god, guys. My foot fell asleep on this floor. Okay. So that is it with this video. That is it with my haul. I'm really happy with everything I got. I hope one of these open up up in Florida because I'll be hitting it up all the time because they had a lot of nice stuff, guys. I ain't even playing. They had a lot of nice stuff. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. And if you guys did, you know what to do. Make sure you click on that subscription button. Make sure you click on that notification bell so you know when my videos are popping. And don't forget to drop a like. In the meanwhile, guys, remember to be blessed. I'll see you guys soon. Mwah!